All right, you guys, this is how I'm gonna start this vlogging of my go wild experience. I'm in my hotel room. I didn't vlog at all the trip here because it was complete chaos. I, well, so what is today? What's today? Today's Thursday. <laughs> it's Thursday, what time is it? I don't know. I'll explain why I'm so out of, like, my mind's not functioning. Um, it's 12.30 in the afternoon Thursday. I got here around the time I was planning on it. However, I was supposed to leave this morning from Madison um, on a plane that left there around six something in the morning. So I was planning on sleeping last night and waking up around four and then going to the airport. Madison's a super small airport, so you don't even have to get there that early. Taking that plane to Chicago, getting on that plane and getting here around now. No, my Madison flight got canceled. So, I mean, I'm really glad that I thought I was quick on my feet. I was like, I know there's a bus that goes to Chicago. So I got bus ticket for $30, went and got on that bus at like 12.30 in the morning. Um, took that bus a three hour ride from Madison to O'Hare in Chicago, and then got at O'Hare a little bit before 4 a.m. and then sat there until my flight boarding was around seven o'clock. The flight didn't even take off though until around eight, I think. Um, but yeah, so that means I have not, because I was planning on sleeping last night, I have not slept for about 31, 32 hours now. That's how long it's been since I've been sleeping. So, I really wanted to go to the thing tonight, the happy hour, <laughs> um, happy hour party. So, I am going to, I think, possibly order room service, maybe? Um, unpack, order room service, unpack, and then try to sleep. That is the goals, but let me just show you the room real quick. Um, it's not the room I had requested, but that's okay. It was ready, and I'm here early, so I was super grateful that they had a room ready for me. Um, so you come in here, a little coffee bar, cabinet under with the ice bucket. Uh, is this club oh, bathroom? Basic tub. It's got nice finishing. I really like the sink. Um, so there you go, that's the bathroom, large mirror, and then a closet over here. Robe hanging up, that won't fit me anyways, I'm sure. A nice long mirror, so that's nice. I'm in all black today. Pretty much that's what I packed, it's black stuff. Um, so the two nightstands, the white linens, a massive headboard. Um, are these lights here? I think so. My mind's not working though to, to, to make them funk, <laughs> to make them work. I need sleep, you guys, I need sleep. All right, and then the TV. I'm guessing a fridge and some drawers. Yep, fridge, safe, drawers, shelves, desk, chair. Yeah, so exciting. This is my view though, see? I've never been to Austin, second time to Texas because I went and visited my dad who um, has a winter home on Padre Island. Um, so we, the girls and I visited him there in February, I believe it was. But there's the capital I see over there off in the distance. All these little shops, that's kind of cool to see all the different shops down there. And yeah, that's my view. So, let's get to, whew, can't see me, hello, wrong way, let's get to unpacking. My husband was so sweet, he knew that I had to catch the bus and I wasn't going to get sleep, but he bought me this peanut butter crispy bar, mmm, these are so delicious, yummy, yummy, yummy. I'm going to save it though, I'm going to save it. Um, we got our go wild room key. Woohoo! That's exciting. Super cute by Chrissy and Designs. Um, yeah, so unpacking. I just noticed you guys, their bath pro products look amazing. Look at that. A lavender facial soap, bath soap, um, some nice conditioner. What is that? Shampoo and body lotion. It just looked really nice, I think. Like the soaps look cute. So I just wanted to show you guys that. I ordered a room service, a margarita pizza, and a Caesar salad, and a soda. And that's what we're start, starting off with. It's supposed to be here in about 30 minutes. It will not focus on me. There it goes. 
<laughs> so yeah, unpacking, continue on. All right, so I emptied out my carry-on suitcase and I'm just gonna show you everything I brought. Um, as I unpacked, it really was not a lot at all. I have three pairs of shoes. I always put them in Ziploc bags in my, when I put them in the um, luggage, just to keep them kind of separate. Um, so I have my like walking around, comfortable shoes and then two flats, um, animal print and then like navy and black with a bow on flats. Over here, I lined up everything. I gotta assemble little gifty things for people. I have some treats, um, some of these little clips I got at Michael's, those ones, these ones. Of course, I was totally slacking on contact cards, so I found these and I'm just gonna write my contact information, their postcards, and I'm just gonna write the contact information on that side. I got these from Target, which I thought were pretty cool. Clips, binder clips, um, fun. And then I have sparkly gel pens. I got those at Target. Some of the bags to put everything in. And then I got some of these Russell Stover uh, Pecan Delights. And then just granola bars um, for inside everything. I think that was it. Yeah, and then I just brought some pens to write on the, on the postcards. Um, these are just the snacks that I had. Planters, some white fudge pretzels, my gum, and then that bar I was showing you. Um, let's see, I got some of my important paperwork, including my Go Wild ticket here. And then for bags, I have this one, which is a crossbody, um, kind of a crossbody messenger. I'm not really good about knowing what everything's called, but it flips over like that. Um, it's black and brown, which I figured would go with most of my outfits. And then I just have this that happens to match a different purse of mine, but I'm just using it to keep my cash. I have, I brought $300 just for like spending cash on stuff when I want to use cash and not credit card. And then my two cards and my ID, and that's all I brought as far as that, that important stuff. Um, oh, and then in here, the drawers. I have um, one, two pairs of black jeans, a pair of like uh, boyfriend blue jeans style, and then two of these pants for pajamas and for plan jamma. And then I have these black pants I'm wearing, black jeans. And here I just have like my socks, underwear, bra, um, a t-shirt though, the, the one that we got last year tell you my mind is not working um a tank top to go underneath and then i bought this just um burgundy burgundy wine colored coach bag for if i go out and about um and i don't want the big like the larger crossover then i have my camera backup stuff backup little uh, memory thing two sets of headphones in case i misplace one um and then over here are the shirts I brought. This is just like a little um, top to go over top of my shirts, obviously. The mind. Okay, and then I have this flowy shirt, black and white. This button down shirt that's black. This shirt, I really like the style of it. It's got kind of like bell sleeves and then the back flares out a little bit. This is what I was planning on wearing tonight where it's got like a lace detail and then a see-through on top there. And this I'm just gonna wear home with the blue jeans, I think, um, on Sunday for the flight back. Okay, in the bathroom I have my sunglasses, a brush, a curling iron, a mishmash of jewelry. I forgot to put my rings on in the panic last last night, trying to figure out how I was gonna get to the airport. But I just got, I have to untangle everything. Um, a couple hair ties, and then all my makeup, tampons just in case, you know. Um, toothpaste, toothbrush, hand lotion, Lips, all the essentials, you know, uh, deodorant and all that good stuff. But there you have it. There is everything I packed for this weekend for the Wild for Planners conference. Woo -woo. Go Wild Austin. All right, I have Caesar salad. That looks yummy. I have a thing for Caesar salads. I just absolutely <laughs> love them. I order them everywhere I go. Every time I, I have room service, I always order Caesar salad and then ooh, a margarita pizza looks delicious so this will be nice because then I can save a lot of it eat a piece or two on the Caesar salad and then go to sleep and then I have a coke 
Hey you guys, it is 7.30, somewhere around that. Let me check the time. Let me check. 7.23 is the time. Um, went down and registered. It took me about five minutes. I, <laughs> I'm just horrible at socializing. I was just in and out, grabbing my stuff stuff and headed right back up to my room this hotel's compact and it's um definitely different from last year it's i mean i like it it's nice um just hop on the elevator go straight down to the ballroom and you're there but anyways i was just going to show you what i got when i registered uh my little card with my name and a functional mess and what is this Oh, Erin Condren, life planner stuff. Swag ticket that they're going to ask for over the next couple days. And then the happy hour invite and information. Yes. Um, and then, of course, I got the Go Wild bag. Sorry, shaking the camera. The Go Wild tote um i love it i think that's so fun what a fun design um so let's open it up and see what's all in here of course t-shirt i'll open that up in a second and show you guys oh and i did take a nap i slept for i don't know three and a half hours or so i have some lovely go wild ladies next to me that were in the hall so it took me a while to fall asleep but that's um i finally knocked out um hand sanitizer thank you very much i did not grab any and i really wanted some hand sanitizer and this is from chrissy Ann designs and then i'm guessing this is a cup so let's open it up and check it out okay so there's my wild t-shirt it's the same one as um when you checked in they were all wearing this all the hilton employees go wild austin 2018 i have a size four tall um so hopefully it'll fit me well it's super soft last year's t-shirt is um was really nice as well it was funny i saw a lady um when i went down wearing the original from new orleans and i said oh you have the original t-shirt oh here's my water bottle which is great Said, oh, you have the original T-shirt, and that original T-shirt I've worn, I worn it out. <laughs> so mine is, hers was like in mint condition, and mine was, mine's, mine's seen better days. Um, my last year one, I actually, yeah, I showed you guys, I, I packed it. So, yeah, that's what we got. I don't think I'm going to happy hour. I, I'm just exhausted. I'm gonna paint my nails and hang out. I feel like this is a repeat of last year. I am. Where I'm gonna do plan jamma and I do feel like I will go to the Erin Condren store. Um, sound like they're gonna have a shuttle to that one of the days. Uh, so yeah, I'm super excited to see and meet more people tomorrow, and yeah, I'm really excited for it. Just wanted to show you guys the fit is perfect. So glad I ordered the size a lot of times. I'll have in my head that I'm gonna lose a ton of weight. <laughs> and I'll go ahead and order a smaller size and then it doesn't happen and then it won't fit me. But yeah, it fits really nice and it feels super comfy and cozy. And this is probably what I'm gonna wear for Plan Jam, I'm guessing. Yep, nice. I'm glad I got the tall one. So it's got some extra length to it. Just wanted to show you guys. Yay!